Welcome and welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, hey, I'm Kwani. If you're an OG Kwan mobster, hey girl. So in today's video, we are trying. What's this called? Angie's. Angie's. Okay, we are trying this new, brand new restaurant that's out here in um, Tempe. We in Tempe, right? Phoenix. No, Phoenix. We in Phoenix. Okay, so it's a brand new restaurant in Phoenix. They just opened, like literally. Well, this location just opened up. I guess they have a couple others, but I never heard of them before. So it's called Angie's Lobster. And um, if you're interested in seeing this video, stay tuned. Welcome to my channel. Welcome to my channel. Hey. Hey. Welcome to my channel. It's the one and only Okay, so we got, we're going to share it because they only have two things on the menu. Oh, smart. That lots of meat do look juicy though. So they offer two things. I'm bringing it a little closer. So this is the lobster roll with the french fries. And both of their combos is $9.99 and you get a, a drink with it. So we both got like a lemonade. Did they cut that in half? I don't know. Darn, how are we supposed to share it? We break it. We just break it, okay. So yeah, like I said, they got the, <laughs> they got the lobster roll and then they got the, um, the lobster fingers. fingers. So yes, we about to say, so we gonna say our blessings real quick oh and then this is the end sauce are you gonna use this i'll try okay you can try mine just in case you don't like it you know open have two them open i just want to say our blessings real quick god is great god is good let us thank him for our food by his hands we are fed thank you lord for our daily bread amen all right so you ready to try okay mm -hmm. What's up? Good. It's good. Come a little closer so you can see him. It's kind of far away. We could definitely tell it first. You want to open it to us? Yeah. Okay. You know, I'm one of those. <laughs> I'm a picky man, so I just start seeing weird stuff. <laughs> you know, it may be normal, but I'm looking like, mm, maybe yeah. I should have got that roll and it came out looking like that. They're giving me five fish. Yeah, more of that. Mm -hmm. Maybe it's like sauce. Oh, and they didn't have tartar sauce, huh? That would be fire with some tartar sauce. Mm. I didn't know this was easier to open. This is like a mess waiting to happen. Wow, so I guess this is the toast. Cause yours is cut in half. That they put the the meat on. Mm -hmm. Okay, you guys. So I'm still doing quantumist, but I'm not numbering the days anymore because last week I don't know if you guys noticed. Um, cause I've been trying to do the premiere. And I had a premiere on December fourth when me and the kids went to Raisin Cane for the first time. You can just pour it right there. It kind of tastes like lobster. It does. It's kind of thick. You like it? I mean, I just got a little whiff of a taste of it. It's a weird taste. It definitely doesn't taste like Mac sauce or In and Out sauce. It got its own taste to it. I could taste a spice to it. Mm-hmm. Because I don't eat spicy food. Yeah, so you'll taste every little bit of spice. So literally, a pinch of spiciness. I can taste. Mm-hmm. Um, and I had tried to upload the video, the Raisin Cane video, 
and it was 7 30 because that was my premiere time 7 30 p.m and my video um wasn't uploaded and it was still staying pending on my end and i was like what the heck is going on so i was like okay you know maybe it's just tripping my video was like 20 something minutes long so i thought maybe that's why but i started uploading it at five so it was basically like two and a half hours and it still didn't upload so then it's now it's like i'm just like okay i'm just gonna leave it alone i went back and checked it was like what 10 o'clock at night and the video still was not uploading so I was like okay let me just wait until I'm gonna go to sleep I'm gonna sleep on it I wake up it's now day five and the video still was not uploaded so I was like what the heck like what the heck is going on like why didn't this video upload so I took it down so instead of it not I didn't take it down so instead of it being on premiere I put publish now so I hit publish now and as it was um processing it said 150 hours and I was like what and uh uh uh, -uh. like this video is not even that long for it to be even doing on that and I kind of like killed my vibe and then um we had to change the wi-fi I even took my phone off of wi-fi like I disconnected it from the wi-fi just in case the wi-fi was wide it wasn't uploading we connected to another network like all that and then it finally loaded like was it late 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 sunday mm -hmm. and it kind of killed my whole mood and all of that so since it it was like that and i feel like it's just best for me to upload off of my job wi-fi i'm not i'm not dating the dates anymore it's not gonna be Quan miss day this, Quan miss day that. It's just gonna say Quan miss. So we'll give it a try next year. <laughs> mm -hmm. Give it a try next year. That's weird. Cause that this is more your kind of thing. That's more my kind of thing. You think so? Mhm. Mm cause it's fried. Yeah. Cause Next time I might get that. We're gonna split this too. You know what I'm saying? Next time I'm not getting that. I mean, it's not horrible. Mm -hmm. It's not horrible at all. But you just would prefer something else. Yeah, it just mm -hmm. don't really tickle my fancy. Yeah, like yeah, it, it's definitely different. But I'm gonna say the lobster meat is definitely juicy. When we got back home from raising Kane last week, <laughs> the kids was like, "The next time we go, are you coming, Dad?" <laughs> and he was like, "I guess I'll give it a try." <laughs> yeah, he's super picky when it comes to like eating stuff. Like he didn't eat lobster until. A couple of years ago, it was my birthday, and I was like, you never ate lobster before? Like, what? Mm-mm. The only seafood was fish, shrimp, and crab legs. Anything else? Nope. I won't even eat, what is that? The fake crab meat. I won't eat Um, that. imitation? Art, yeah, that imitation artificial. <laughs> I won't eat it. I still won't eat it. Yeah, mm-mm, he won't. And then he doesn't even eat shrimp like that. Right. But once he tried lobster for the first time, he like I was hooked on it. Mm -hmm. I think it was more or less the fact that I ain't know how to cook it at that time. A lot of times we go to the stores and they just be like, mm. they be finicky how they be cooking stuff sometimes. It be too rubbery, like they cooked it too long. We wasn't getting that texture of the food. No, yeah, it's not bad. Not that long ago, I ate red lobster. Mm-hmm. That's your first time trying it. I never been to Olive Garden. Um, Outback Steakhouse. 
What restaurants have you been to? Cause I feel like you haven't been to a lot of them. I remember 2013 was my first time ever going to Denny's. Yeah. <laughs> I'm like, you never had Denny's? Oh, we going there first. And we got breakfast. Well, I got breakfast. I think you got... I don't even remember. Did you get the steak? Yeah. Because I'm more of a... I was more of an IHOP guy. Mm-hmm. Vice of how people are more... When it comes to churches and Popeyes. Yeah, more of a Popeyes. Mm-hmm. I'm more of a churches. Like Burger King, McDonald's. All right. So. Pizza Hut, Domino's. Who do you prefer? Papa John's. Did you eat Papa John in New York or once we got together? Once we got together. Because I had never um, heard Papa John's until I moved to Arizona. I mean, they had it. Did yeah. I get it on my shirt? No. Okay, good. Um, they have it on the East in. My bad, sorry, I didn't mean to cut you off. Oh, you're cool. I'm not getting excited. You know, now I just had it. I just, I didn't go eat. It was no. right there on Graham Avenue. When they build that? I don't yes, feel like they had no. that when I was a kid. They did. And I don't know, I didn't see Papa John until we moved out here. You ain't got to think about it. When we, when we grew up in New York, we in selected little areas that we <laughs> barely ever leave out of. Mm-hmm. I'm all over. Anyway. I'm on Knickerbocker, Bushwick. I lived in Best Eye. I lived in Clinton Hill. And I lived in Long Island. And, um, you know, I was in East New York. I was downtown Brooklyn a lot. That's because you don't bet that. Mm hmm. I gotta do pay attention. I'm good with directions, I pay attention. I didn't watch that car do a U-turn like five times. He waiting for people to come out that gate. Mm-hmm. I'm ready to try this. <laughs> this. You ain't trying yet? No, I've been waiting for you. Oh, God, stop. Are you going to break it? No, I was just eating it without the bread. Oh, you're going to eat it without the bread? I don't care for bread. Uh-uh. We're not, we're not going to mess up the sandwich like that. The only time I really care for bread is peanut butter and jelly or ham. <laughs> really, nigga? <laughs> What? I really don't care for bread. You ever notice when we eat too many fish? I be eating. You eat out the bowl. The you eat it out the bowl. Yeah. Well, I like my tuna with crackers anyway. But I didn't notice that. You know, that's probably why you make your your tuna sandwiches so thin. I don't like stretching it. <laughs> nah, you be making the skimpy tuna. But I bet you you get more sandwiches though. Skinny sandwich. Right. I got one thick sandwich. Survival, girl. Oh, that man went late. Yeah, it's like five at night. Even though it's dark out there. Now you frog again. Either they hit or we just hungry. Yeah. But they good. I think they're good. I don't think we're just hungry. No, nah, because I'm so picky that if it's nasty, I'd rather stay hungry. <laughs> <laughs> you know, no lie. When it's something that I think is so good, I really be hoping he don't like it so I can eat. <laughs> and then he would be like, so what do you think? And he would like, you know, that's all right. Mm. Oh, it's true. My boobs. Mm, we'll get it out. Mm. It's right there on top. Not better that you got it. Why? Because I'm in an angle. Oh, I feel like this made it soggy. They probably would have pushed it further down. Oh, you know, I don't like soggy bread. And I feel like this made it soggy. And the meat is cold. Yeah. Is it? Why ain't it? Why did they heat it up? 
They gave us cold meat. Want to taste it? It's seafood. You know seafood get cold quick, quick. No, that's cold, cold. That wasn't heated up. I thought I thought the sandwich. I'm sorry, you guys. I never had a po' boy before. I was under the impression that the meat was cooked. I didn't know it was cold meat. It's so good. Mm-hmm. It's real good. And I'm over here talking crap. Mm -hmm. Oh, you know why I probably thought it was warm? Because that first piece that I took was on the french fries. Mm -hmm. And that's why we warmed it up. Probably. I'm not selling it, so be careful. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, you can take it off the bread. Oh, boy. You never tell me you could have took my bread. I did take your bread. <laughs> That's why I just took it. No, I'm talking about from before. You know, you was like, you don't like soggy bread? Mm-hmm. I never used my bread. Mm -hmm. You don't want it? <laughs> <laughs> you don't really like it. Mm -hmm. Raisin King toast is really good, too. Really? Mm-hmm. Let me taste theirs and see what they toast about. Without the the meat inside. Oh, it's basically right away. Mmm. It's about to toast. You can taste the butter. I think most of the taste was a little more toastier. Mmm. As it's chewing, you can really taste the butter. Mmm. So, quick question for y'all. What do y'all think is a good state to live in? I want to hear y'all feedback on that. No, normally I don't ask no questions. <laughs> you want some more french fries? My bad. You sure? Mm hmm. I got a grip. Well, not a grip left, but a nice chunk of out. Sure I'm not putting any butter. It's okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this is nice. This is pleasant. <clears throat> I never had anything like this before. I never had like anything fried lobster. Like, only thing fried I had was shrimp. Well, you know, it's a crazy thing. As the woodfence is eating, we can go by the area where it is, and then y'all can see how this line goes. Yeah. It'll literally clear for one second, and then you'll turn around, and it's wrapped. I'm like, and you was in that line. How did you think it flowed? I don't know. It was did pretty good. I mean, it was just chilly outside. <laughs> Look at this. And they said it's supposed to be a drive through, but there's a walk through. Oh, because it's on a food truck. <laughs> like when we pulled up, <laughs> when we seen the gate. <laughs> was wrapped around a Taco Bell. So we were like, what? They couldn't even like remodel it, make it there to just want to use Taco Bell. It, it just don't say Taco Bell on it. And the colors are a little faded. Crazy thing is, it's right outside that Taco Bell building. Taco Bell said, forget that building. They moved right across from it. Oh, wow. 
that's crazy. Mm -hmm. And the kids, <clears throat> they're at a birthday party, so that's why they're not with us. Yeah. I'm tired as hell. What time you be waking up? I had to wake up this morning because Makai has swim class. So I had to wake up oh, at 7 o'clock in the morning. They're doing that now? They don't have swim class. They don't swim class every day. I didn't know they were doing it because I need to, I need to, especially because oh, he's yeah, older. You're getting too old. Now nah, I know how to swim. Yeah. Did you go on this, Saya? This? I'm about to for you. All right. So you're about to go on this one, right? Oh. <laughs> Baby, why are you? Whoa. Which is probably about us because because they're so little we don't give them seafood just yet. What's well, that for sign? Baby steps. Mm hmm That's much better. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Like we let them eat shrimp. It's on some bright lights. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> I think he had crab like twice. Um, when my brother made that seafood gumbo, mm. he had the seafood in there. We need to try other restaurants that we never ate at before. Mm -hmm. <coughs> I feel like we go to the same ones. Well, being because I got the, where I work at, that's where the hell we live, I don't drive no more. Mm hmm. So I literally drove like maybe 10 blocks the other day, and that was a mission to me. I mean, oh, you got that rusty? Yeah, I haven't drove in a long time. Well, I know. I mean, it wasn't like, it was like far, like West Bubble, far, mm -hmm. or like it was like a little more far. That just felt like, I think a it lot. felt good to drive. Mm-hmm. Cause you don't have to drive to work and stuff no more. I drive a golf cart. <laughs> Not the same? Yeah, it's definitely different from driving one of our cars. Mm -hmm. It's crazy because wherever we live, you usually live the furthest away. From the job. Mm -hmm. Now we live the closest. Now I live so far from my job. Man. Did they give us napkins? No. Ah, oh, I you know, I do not like <clears throat> when restaurants don't get are they called condiments? Yes. Yeah, a napkin a condiment? It could be, cause I know like when hmm. they don't give you your spoons, your forks, forks and your and napkins, mm-hmm, a straw. <coughs> Excuse me. How's the lemonade? Ooh, this top almost came off. Yeah, they're clumsy. Yeah, very. You gotta push it down. Push it down. Yeah. Ooh. See, and pull it out. If you want to. I mean, it still was drinkable like that. Oh. Is you sipping? Mm hmm. Ooh, yeah. Mmm. 
Mm. Remember um Anne's pretzel? Mm -hmm. It kind of tastes like that. The lemonade. Mm. But um <clears throat> yeah guys, we're gonna go ahead and end the video here. We taste the food. So like always, thank you for taking the time out of your day to spend a moment out of my day with me. Bye guys. Mm.